So I'm starting off this haul with a very light load. I just had two different things I wanted to show you guys. I did order some more flight trackers from Crest Press. They have been out of stock, I think. At least when I looked for them, they weren't there. So I just figured I saw them in stock, so I just bought, I think, three more. Yeah, I buy them in like loads of three. I love these so much. Now I have six, but the other one has like a bunch missing already. And then this is also a limited edition freebie. She used to do these in like all different monthly colors, but she just has been throwing them in because I think they were really highly requested. And they are her bottom washi, which I might actually use this um, in my 4th of July spread. So I think that's super awesome. And I'm going to go ahead and put this in my binder. I'm actually going to show you guys how I kind of do this. So I have all of my freebies for Caress Press up front. So I have a May one, a Father's Day one, a Hello Summer limited edition countdown thing, and then this guy here, and then all of my flight trackers I put in this little sleeve, which is its own flight tracker sleeve, and then I have all of my other stickers, so any type of like functional deco stickers in here or anything like that. And then whenever you flip here, this is all my donut shop collections. And then I just have all of my Crest Press kits that I have not used yet. And there's some really good ones in there. And I recently, if you saw on Instagram, printed out um, rainbow colored headers, headers, uh, binder edges, I guess. I don't know, for all of my favorite shops. And then I also have like an other uh, this month and the next month. And I also love Crest Press's packaging, super cute. And then I just wanted to show you guys, this I found at Target, and I just thought this was like one of the most A-plus kits that I've seen in a very long time from them. So this would fit in a uh, Target binder, or like any of these like three ring binders. So there's page flags, larger page flags that are kind of like sticky notes, and I like how this one's lined up so you could do a checklist. Then you have note pages that are perforated, and then the stickers are getting a little bit more planner related. Normally they're just like, shapes but this one has appointment lunch time workout payday coffee break and then it has reinforcement dots email call pay and shop so i thought this was really cute for three dollars and it's one of the new items in the line so in this portion of the haul i or i ordered i got these at target i'll show you guys the stuff i got at target and then i got one thing in the mail so I'm going to throw in here. So the first thing I got was this binder. And I do have like a binder set up. And I don't really need another one. But I just thought this one was way too cool. It's like a marbly kind of galaxy looking print. And it was at Target. And it's just a three ring binder. And it is from the brand Mara Me. So I just picked this up. And I will find something to do with it. And then I also picked up a pack of these. Normally I order them on Amazon. But I just needed them like needed them now so they're the mini binder sheet protectors and these are like four dollars for 15 but i know that they're cheaper on amazon and then i also picked up a um another one of these i just got another one of these recently but these are like brighter and cute so these are the mini binder refills they're three dollars and they come with post-it so there's two larger ones and strips and then they have some like appointment stickers some little like appointment boxes, reminder appointment, and like little things on here. And then just your average like little notepad you could stick in a three ring binder. And I think this was pretty cool for, for Target for three bucks, heck yeah. Also got another order in from Paper Rose Planning. And I ordered some monthly kits from her before. I'm like, I, I really hit planner piece. Um, and I feel like when I hit planner piece, I like get like anxious and want to like try something different, but um, I got these whenever I was like down with using my personal planner, which I might go back to. I don't know. I don't know what's going on right now, but I ordered these. They're super cute. They're on matte paper, which I prefer to use in my personal planner because it's like very much so white space. And I thought these were really cute. I want to like see the thing is is like everyone makes these really cute like little sets that I want to use in my planner. I just don't know how I'm going to like implicate them, but I hope that I can find a really cool way because these are super adorable. So this is a pineapple one. And then this one's kind of like a rainbowy, pretty one. And her stuff is really nice, especially like even the matte. Like I like it a lot. And the cuts are like on point. And then there is a mermaid one, and then her little sampler, which is also matte. And again, that was paper rose planning. Got some stuff in the mail, and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So I got something in the mail from Coffee Monsters. Coffee Monsters Co. So, let's see. 
there is, ooh, okay. So this is her reformatted kit, I think she said. Ooh, okay, cool. Okay, 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 okay. So let's show, let's show this, okay. So this is her new like format, I guess. And she sent me like all of the pages of it. So this is the washi page and then there are half boxes, there's headers and then like little um, appointment labels. This is like a functional page as weekend banner icons, checklists, flags, and things like that. These are her full boxes, which like I said in my last video, I really love this one. I love this one as well. And then there are the ombre art checklists. Then she also sent me this one, which is super pretty as well. Ooh, I really like this one. Okay, so this one has your washi page, the half boxes, which are adorable, and then the headers and the like mini appointment labels. The, she must send me two of these guys. The, oh, this is really pretty. I really like this. This is like uh, full boxes, I love this girl. And then floral of July, that's so pretty. And then the like ombre heart checklist, well checklist, so super cute, thank you so much. We'll move on to Caress Press, which is, you know, one of my faves. And again, I feel like I just ordered this yesterday, yep. This is the one I literally feel like I just ordered yesterday. So I got, as a freebie, I got another one of those um, bottom washies. And so cute. Her stuff is so nice. So let's go ahead and open these. The first one is Beach Business. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit more. Beach Business. And this is adorable so this is the functional page like i said before i love that she's doing like the mini icons and then i also like the like deco functional here are the full boxes which i really love the greens and like the darker colors in here and then the like quote is ocean air salty hair and i love like the girls like they're so cute so those are the full boxes i love how detailed they are then there are like little date cover-ups half boxes three art checklists and then little quarter boxes then there are her headers and her little things on the bottom. Then it was so funny because I mentioned in my one video, I was like, oh, she should get rid of like one of these um, washi things and put the deco up here. And she actually messaged me like the day I put it up and a picture of this. I don't know if it was this one, but I think it might've been. And she was like, great minds think of like, and I was like, girl, you know it. So she has the deco up top and I love her deco. It's like always the perfect size. It's so cute, dainty, I love it. And I love like the girls, they're so cute. And then there are four different options for pattern washi and four different options for solid. Then you have your ombre heart checklist, your bottom washi, which is perfect. And then kind of like your sidebar stuff, bill dues and things like that on there. So I love it. I can't wait to add it to my caress press library. And then I also picked up the Candy Crush. I wasn't really going to get this one, but I thought it was just kind of really fun. And I would find some time that I feel like would be very, like, appropriate for this. And this is her functional page. Then this page is the full boxes. And this one says, Life is Short, Eat Dessert First. And it has just different candies on it. Then you have your headers and little things. I loved this page. Kind of sold it for me. It has the headers half boxes and I just love the like backgrounds in there. Then you have your washi, deco, and the solid washi. Then you have your heart checklist and I love this bottom washi. Sidebar stuff on there as well. So that is Candy Crush Kit. And that was everything from Caress Caress. Super excited to use that. And then I also got something from a shop and I'm super excited about it because I'm going to be using it this week. By the time that you see this, it'll already be up. Go ahead and open it. And this, oops, there's a card in there. Let me get the card out. This is from Pretty On, Pretty On, Pretty On Paper Co. And there is a little note in here. So I'm going to go ahead and take a look. See, that's so cute. It has like glitter watermelon on it. Let me see. And then in the, if you guys want to order from her, I'll leave her link down below like I do for everyone. And her coupon code that she made is for 15% off of your order. And it's Andrea, my name, A-N-D-R-E-A, -E 15. Um, and this is the Just Keep Swimming for the Finding Dory release. 
And she also threw in some shopping day stickers for me, which is very appropriate. So thank you very, very much, Chrissy. And again, I will leave her linked down below. But this is her finding jewelry kit, which I was just going to use like July colored stuff because I feel like July colors will work with my sticker books. And I'm so happy. She did message me saying that she did release glossy ones. And I was like, yes. So again, this is Pretty on Paper Co. So it's Pop Co. And on the first page, she has a weekend banner, some to-do and today headers, little arrows, heart checklists, some little quarter boxes, some little like crossed out, so now happening Netflix wins and can adult, some mini, well, I guess they're kind of like midi icons, bill dupe, little stickers, and then it has on the bottom her website, her Instagram, and then her YouTube channel. On here is the full boxes, so you have um, nine of them, and then Three of them do uh, do have um, quotes on them. I laugh because I have courage to touch the butt. And then there are some little extra headers on the bottom. This paper feels really nice. Then there are ombre art checklists, so there are nine of them. And then some little like deco functional on the bottom. So you have plan, date night, laundry, lazy day, scale, a little envelope, and a payday. Here you have a ton of little things and then also date covers. So you can put the little star and then the day of the week next to it. Then you have washi, which is also on glossy. There's bottom washi and then solid washi. There are nine half boxes, bits and bobs, which is super cute. And then these are just like sidebar stickers. And then this is another kit and this just has um, whales on it. So I just kind of flip through this because it's the same format. And then, ooh, and then, oh yeah, I remember these. These are shopping day stickers, which have Lush bags, makeup, and um, so like Sephora bags, and then um, Bath and Body Works. So these are super cute. So I'll definitely use those as well. So thank you very much. I'm so excited to use this with Finding Dory. And I love um, Pixar premieres because they're honestly the best. You guys will have seen this in a plan with me already, but I just thought I'd throw it into this haul. Hey guys, it's Andrea, and I am going to film the last segment of this haul. It's getting to be a very large haul. Sorry if you hear my bathtub draining in the background. Um, but I came home from vacation, and I have a lot of things to show you guys. I have one, two, three, four, five, six things to show you. Plus this glam planner sack, which I'll show you guys first. So I went to Elle's wedding, and then we also like co-honeymooned, and she gave me a bunch of different kits here. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys all of these kits. So if we go ahead and open this one, this is her wedding kit. And I used a different kit for her wedding in my planner just because, um, oops, I just dropped the freebie. Um, because I didn't have it, I wanted to plan before I left. So there are the full boxes, and then you have uh, six of the heart checklists, and then two full boxes there. The half boxes, a flag, some deco, habit stickers, and... Uh, like weekly habits and then this one has like the two stickers for like long ones for the weekend and then a bunch of deco weekend banner little things headers and then the washi like I said I already went to her wedding so I'm probably going to use this for my friend and Nick's friend uh, Brian and Kira's wedding and it also came with a freebie and that's always on matte paper I'll show you some last. This is her like peacock I think collection and or is it? I don't remember. This one says live in color. It has the same freebie which the like the art and that matches this one. So this one has the full boxes, the um the heart checklists the weekly ombres, the half boxes, some other stickers, little things, headers, weekend banner, and then the washi, and I like the gold accents in this kit. Then there is this kit, which I'm sorry if you guys saw these all already, if you guys like watch her videos, because there's a lot of stuff here. I'm not sure what this one's called. I think it's like summer, something summer. Every summer has its own story. I love this one. I love this art, and again, with the gold. I'm not going to tell you what each sheet is. So I'm just going to flip through them. Okay, and then I also have the bachelorette kit, even though I already went on Elle's bachelorette party. I won't be going on another bachelorette party for a while. I don't think Kirsten is having one, 
and um, the next person that I'm like semi involved with like are like really good friends with the person who's getting married is Brie and her bachelorette party won't be till next summer but I'll probably use this for something else like a Vegas weekend so there is a freebie and then you have the full boxes this I love the deco on this one it's so cute and the glitter on the boxes and then you have this sheet which I love the purple so 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 cute so that is the bachelorette kit and then also the glamping kit which remember this haul because in a couple of months I'm going to be talking about this glamping kit um so this is the full boxes Oop. full boxes heart checklist I love the deco on this one so cute and then also I really like the bottom washi on that one. So that is glamping. And this one has a little bit of a different freebie. I thought I wasn't filming for a second. And this is her mystery kit. She accidentally showed this a little bit in her in my Instagram post of these kits. And everyone, I don't know if anyone actually noticed. Somebody said that there was non-release ones and this was the only one that wasn't released yet. But it's really, really pretty. I remember when she was designing this, I was really excited because it's very travel-y. And even though I don't plan on traveling for the next couple months, I just kind of like chill. I think it's really, really pretty and the colors go together really well. So this is like the deco sheet, then the like sidebar stickers and other things down here, half boxes, the full boxes, wonder the world and smell the roses, the checklists, the headers and little things, and then the washi page. So that is that kit so those are all of the kits from glam planner and i have to put those all away then i have a lot of stuff to put away that's why i wanted to film this video i do have a couple of orders from like the same people i have i think these are all from caress press so these three are i have two from evie lou and co and then i also have some custom covers i ordered on etsy so i'm just going to go through the caress press stuff first so she did send me her mystery kit um she sent me like this i think she sent all of these in one i think i'm did i order th this one no i think she just sent me all of this just for like funsies and i was like oh my god thank you so much it's amazing i love it um i had actually ordered these ones and she like canceled my order and was like girl i already sent them to you and i was like oh my god so you guys know that i love crust press stickers this was her mystery kit it's called mad tea party mystery kit and i think that this is going to be so pretty i might save this till next year or it'd be really pretty with these like september colors um like the purple so you got your deco deco sheet and then you have this sheet which i love the format of this i think it's so cute your full boxes your headers and little things your half boxes and your date covers along with some of the little extras on the side deco on top pattern washi solid washi heart checklists and then the last page is your sidebar stuff bill dues and then your bottom washi which this kit is pretty cute pretty cute pretty cute i love it so i'm gonna stick this back in the container if i sound a little like lackluster because i'm filming really late at night but i'm like super excited and i already went through and opened all of this stuff so this is just me re-going through it whenever i came home the first thing i did was like open the door and was like <gasps> the packages i love them Okay, and then this one is the $75 plus freebie, and this one is just like a really cute, like, summer-themed one. And I save all of her freebies and have them in the front of my Crest Press little section, which I showed you guys in my last, was it my last haul? This is the Pop Art Kit. So again, you have this, which I love these colors. It reminds me of, like, Frozen Glitter, these colors. I love them. Um, so I think that this would be, like, a really nice, like, um like universal year round and I love the like black and white it's so pretty so buttery the pages are the deco is super cute heart checklist I love the bottom washi so pretty she never disappoints never ever ever so I have that one as well <gasps> Ooh, this one's pretty I love the glitter it's making my eyes do fun of things okay so this is the first page and I love the amount of glitter on here you guys see that yes it says salt in this salt in the air sand in my hair i love that so cute i like these textures here these like basket kind of ones so pretty i love the tan and then the like sand so it's like tan tan and sand i guess <gasps> ooh. okay and then ooh, i like these and then the deco is so pretty look at the deco so cute 
And then the ombre, or not ombre hair checklist, just regular checklist, but like the glitter. Yes. Ooh, I'm so excited to use this one. I need to use it. I'm not going to the beach anytime soon. But I'm going to use it for something. Something, something, something. And then she also sent me this, which I was like, why is this so big? And she sent me this cover and I, in a little note, and she's so sweet. I love her so much. Um, I actually saw this cover on Instagram and I was going to ask her if she was like selling them or selling the design. And I saw in the comments that she said she wasn't. And I was like, oh, darn, like I don't want to bother her. And she actually sent it to me. It's like we have some ESP connection. And this is like goals. And it says Lady Boss. It says scroll prints go on the side. It has like a little Louis kind of like, I don't even know what it is. It looks like a blanket. And then like this girl with like crazy hair reminds me of me. It's just like in a Louis blanket. That's what it reminds me of. I don't know if it's supposed to be something else. But that's what like I'm feeling from this. And I really love it. And I think it's going to look so pretty with the black coil like i'm planning on switching this out as soon as i like i'm done with this video thank you so much You're such a sweet girl um let's go on to evie lou and co i actually made a boom boom and i ordered this kit twice like i don't know really what i was thinking i was probably like ordering it when it was released and then when i saw it again with this like I was like buying this I saw this I was like oh like I need that and I already had it so oops I'll probably just give this to Kirsten because I feel like she would really like this so I'm gonna just give that to her and um I love Evie Lou and Co oh my goodness she my girl she my girl can't wait to meet her okay so let's get back into this I'm just gonna go on and on about people but like these are my like my tops guys my I feel like I'm always asked to do a like top Etsy shop, but I mean, if you guys really watch my hauls, you guys know who my top Etsy shops are. Also, if you've seen my like binders, I mean, I do like a lot of other, ooh, I do like a lot of other Etsy shops. So that's why I don't ever want to do like a top one because I do have like a lot of shops that I really like. But I mean, if you guys want a video of like my top shops and then like me tell you guys and you believe that like there are tons of other shops that I like I just do I personally do have favorites and that's just the way that it is so let me know if you guys want to see that um I'll put it up but I've just been wary because I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings by them not being in the top shop or anything like that I know I'm crazy so first is a little sampler which I think is cool that it is in here and it's like the freebie which I prefer this over like a freebie that doesn't really match anything so I've been loving these I like for a while what was happening with her kits is i would never have a i just recently made her a binder but i would never have her kits long enough like i'd always get them and use them immediately so i'm starting to have like a stash and i've really been enjoying it and i love that she has a binder now and i just think it's so cute with the rest of them on there so these are the washi which are on matte paper so you have your bottom washi and your regular washi there then you have your little bits which i love that she calls them little bits i think she changed her font which I do like this better. I think it'll go better with like glam planner headers and my headers as well. And then the um, half boxes down here, headers, and then like these little boxes here. The ombre heart checklist, which I love. Her hearts are like little fat chunky hearts. I think they're so cute. Then this page, so I love that she's did different icons. I think she started doing this like last release. And then the um, okay, the like functional deco is so pretty the only thing that i wish though is that these came in different colors because they're always all one color that's the only thing that i could ever think of but like this like i don't know like i rarely ever use these stickers but for some reason they're always my favorite stickers in um in like a kit and i think that hers are really cool because what she does is, is she has all these little hearts and they all it makes it the clip art that she used like all like really go together and i think that it just gives it a very cute vibe and i love it and just this kit in general is just adorable i think it's so cute it's so nautical but so tropical at the same time and i really really can't go wrong with nautical and tropical and i just think it's so pretty and i love navy stickers it's another one of my like favorite things this is the kit that i ordered twice um i'm gonna text kirsten and ask her if she wants the other one I really just liked it that much, guys, that I ordered it twice. Um, so the first one, which I don't, I think I might have ordered this, um, this clip art. I, I saw, like, whoever, I don't remember who it was, whoever, I mean, these guys all whoever released it, I was like, oh, like, I did buy this, which is close to this as far as, like, 
it being like seashells and stuff and I was like I really hope somebody I like does a kit with this clip art and I feel like somebody else did one and I might have ordered it but I don't remember who it was but I love this art so much I love watercolor and nautical stuff so this was like all right at my alley so this is the freebie and then you have your washi which is on the matte paper and the rest of the stickers are glossy I love the color selection here the like mid-tone blue light blue and like a sky blue and then the tan and again with this like this little section here goals and I also again love the choice of icons and then this is the full boxes and it's so pretty I love the like script on this one it's just so good so that is that kit and I'm very excited to use it um let me just put these back. And then the last one, I thought it was... No, actually, there's two more. Okay. I got a little bit of a problem here, guys. A little bit of an obsession. So this one I ordered... I think I ordered four at the same time or three. I don't know. So this one is so cute. I really fell in love with the yellow. And, like, this is kind of like a puke green. But, like, I fell in love with that, like, combo. It's like a chartreuse almost. So you have your freebie, and then you have your bottom washi and your regular washi, which are matte. I love this pink. I think it's the combo of, like, the pink, yellow, and chartreuse, like, because these are very, like, they're not, like, my favorite colors, but I think in this kit with the pink, it just really goes. I really love that green. I feel like it's a color Tara would really like, too. She really likes colors like that. And then these are the full boxes. So it's a very, like, summer, fun, bright spread. Then... The last one's a back to school kit and I actually wrote in the notes and I was like, girl, I don't even have kids, like, I'm not in school, but doesn't mean I can't plan a back to school spread, right? So this is the freebie. I think another one that I fell in love with. I really been liking like the yellow. I don't know, is this like a new thing for me? So then they have the washi, the yellow, which yes, yes, yes. And then the headers, half boxes, heart checklist, and again, winning on the functional deco, and then the full boxes, which this is back to school, but I don't think it's like that if you don't go to school, you can't use this. I think that if you were like, I really like this kit, but I'm not going to school, I think you should still get it. So that is all from Evie Lou & Co. And then the last part of this haul, which is going to be the last part of the overall haul, is from a shop. I don't know really how I stumbled upon this shop. But the shop is called Stylish Planner, and she makes planner covers. She makes dashboards, too. I'm not super sure. Um, but I ordered some planner covers, and these are so pretty. Um, they were $16.50 each, which I don't really know how much that compares to Erin Condren covers. But these are, like, handmade by somebody with love. So I'm going to show you guys the, like, ones that I was, like, I saw first. So I saw these, and I thought they were very, like, Lily Pulitzer. Ooh, let's zoom out a little. Very, like, Lily Pulitzer-esque. There's no, like, customization on these, but I just thought they were so cute, and they'd be really pretty for summer. I probably won't put these on right now just because, like I said, they're super summery. But, I mean, I could if I wanted to, and they are alligators and uh, flamingos. And I just thought, again, these were super Lily Pulitzer, and I had to have them. And then I got this one, which I think I'm more in love with than I thought, which is going to be a hard toss-up between this and the Lady Boss. I might just have, like, joint custody of my planner with these two covers. So, this is just, like, the most gorgeous cover ever. It has, like, a plain blue back. It's just plain blue and then white. And then it has these black and blue flowers and then this, like, gold foil, my name. Like, what? Yes? Oh my god, I love this so much. So that was again from Stylish Planner. I always have everybody linked down below if you guys missed it. Um, I am so excited to use all of these stickers. It was such a nice surprise to come home to like a bazillion sticker orders. What happened here? Gotta put these under. So I'm just gonna talk as I lay these out. But you guys know I'm a sticker crazy person. I tried doing a no buy in May and it didn't really, or was it June? May? And it didn't really work out, so I'm not gonna try that anymore. I'm just giving up. It's okay to give up. Um, but I love everything. Like, oh, I'm so, so excited. So 
So I hope that you guys like this haul. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Check out all the shops that I mentioned down below. They are all amazing ladies, and I love them all so much. And they're amazing to work with, and I have some exciting orders coming in for my next haul. So be sure to subscribe so you guys see that when it comes up. But I will talk to you guys in my next video.